Hello friends and hello student. My name is Ashok Sijala. In this session, we learn the given number is octal or not in C language. So first I share my laptop screen and fix the position here so you can watch better in my video lecture. And here Turbo C++, I double click and take some process. And now yes, is open ultra F file menu, taking new file and here our goal, write a program to check even number is octal or not. So this that is also definition as a number programming so like uh, Armstrong or not, time number or not, factorial number or not. So octal is the base is eight and zero to seven that eight digit. So yes, I think you have know very well. So now I directly start our header file standard input output and that is a link section in C programming. So console on your dot H console input output and then void main. Yes. And now we can declare some that is an integer variable. So that is a N and separate the digits. So D and clear the screen. Yes. And now we can first that our input so input, output, and process. So first, the divide and conquer. That is my always technique. So input is one integer number. So enter one integer number. That is our input. And that check that number is a octal or not. That is a process. And print the message. So that is our output. So yes, here we can scan. And now we can start our second part. That is a process is logic. So while loop is a best for number programming and is greater than zero. And now we have to take first separate the digit. So D equal to N modulo 10. So that is a separate the digit. And here we can check number is greater than or equal to uh, that is a eight. So that is a base eight. So we can check if greater than equal to eight. So that is not a octal number and otherwise that is a octal number. So uh, we can say that the given number is not octal octal number or we can say that not octal. Yes. And return, yes, here we can use return keyword, not a back keyword because back is a, we cannot use otherwise what message read. No, a given number is not octal and given number is octal. So now we can take uh, n divided by 10. So that is a new number and check the while loop again. And now after the while loop, we can print if uh, that cursor is written. So that is not and not uh, going if condition. So that uh, we can say that even number is octal. So that perfectly. So given number is octal number or just octal. And then get here. So yes, I very simple. So I can save this definition. So we can say that OCT underscore NUM dot C. So octal number. So that is save. And I compile. So yes, there is no any error. Our exe file is generated. And now I can run. So first I check like uh, we can say that one, two, three, four, five. Yes. So that is a let us check. So the given number is not octal. Yes, here that is a print. So yes, now again I run and that is, uh, we can say that given number is, we can say that like uh, greater than, so like eight, nine, seven. So that is a, you can look, the given number is not octal. So previously that is a octal. So again, I run and give the same one, two, three, here, four. So given number is octal number. Yes, because below the eight. So one, two, three, four digits. So, so given number is octal. Yes, so perfectly. And let us check. We can trace this logic. So I think very simple, but you can understand better. So alter W I take as a watch window. Yes, and alter W that is output window. And now I can set the watch. So green spawn, enter, P press, and N. So that is only two variable N and D. So 
now start F7 function key. And yes, uh, our output window is clear. And then I take like one, two, three. So let us check how that possible that number is octal. So yes, you can look that uh, separate the digits. So here D is for three, yes, and greater than eight, no. So new number is 12. Again, that while loop check and two separate the digit 12. So, so two separate and not greater than. So again, one and is greater than yes. And now one separate and digit store one yes that not if condition is false and now zero so while loop is false and the given number is octal is print so that is a the number is octal and now again i run so how not octal number so like check i give like any number so greater than eight so like uh, uh, one two and eight so 128 so eight is there so that not is octal so I press F7, yes, here eight is separate, greater than equal to, so that is if condition is true. So given number is not octal and return. So yes, that directly you can see in output window, the given number is not octal and alter F5 function key. So that is, you can also watch console screen. So how this shortcut key, alter F5, that is alter W here, user screen, alter F5, that is shortcut key to see your screen or ask your output of C or any C++ programming. So yes, very simple definition. So given number is octal or not, we have to just check. So that is a base of eight. So we can uh, apply to this logic. If digit is greater than or equal to eight. So that is a not octal because octal number zero to seven only eight, that type of zero also included and seven. So greater than equal to so that is a not octal number. So yes, I hope you can understand and enjoy this session. Very simple and interesting logic. Yes. So write this program to your C notebook and any doubt for this definition or any concept in C language, you can write in comment section. I give the definitely to answer you. Now I can close this session and close first I file. Yes. And watch an output and quit. So subscribe my channel or shop Jal icon and press the bell icon to never miss any update from my channel. And thanks for your watching, supporting and sharing my video lecture and Hare Krishna.